what is up everybody i hope you're having a fantastic day so guess what we got our hands on today a brand spanking new 2020 iphone se i know you guys have probably wanted to get your hands on this i have too but it's so expensive iphones are so expensive nowadays guys so i found one on ebay i'm super excited to open it up for you guys and give you an honest review and let you know if i think you guys should buy it so the new iphone se it has a 4.7 inch display so pretty good size um it's also got the iphone 8 design so it looks like one but it's actually an se so it comes with the se features including touch id i have missed touch id so much since i switched to a newer iphone where there's only face id i miss the touch id because sometimes i don't want apple to know what my face looks like what that's kind of creepy also it's got a single lens rear camera so you don't got to worry about scratching multiple cameras you only have the one so you can take all the pictures you want and they also come in red white and black so i decided to order a white one because i thought it would look the cutest so this is a picture of what it looks like as you can see i'll zoom in a little bit it's got that really sleek design you know apple is always coming out with the like sleekest new design um there is no headphone jack which is okay because that means it'll be really thin so it's easier to carry around it just it holds better in your hand so yeah that's what it looks like i'm super excited to unbox it because i really want to know if it's worth the price because it's kind of expensive i bought one on ebay though so i could get it for a little bit cheaper but it's the seller said it was brand new there shouldn't be any issues with it so i'm really excited to go ahead and unbox this for you guys so Here's the box it came in. They were used an Amazon one. And as I'm shaking it up, um, it feels pretty light, but there definitely is something in there, as you can hear, because the iPhone SE is pretty thin and it's fairly small. It's smaller than the other iPhones. So it makes sense that this package is really light, which also means it'll be less hard to carry it around, you know, when you go to the grocery store, when you're going for a walk, you know, anything you're doing, this thing, it's it's gonna work. It's gonna be easy to carry around. So let me get out my pocket knife really quick. And I'm going to go ahead and cut this tape off so we can take a look inside and check out the new iPhone SE. Oh, there we go. Wasn't taped very well. That's okay. Okay guys, I'm gonna let you look first. Ready? I'm scared. Ready? What the heck? How long have these been in here? It smells like banana bread. Are you serious? Ew, look how brown these are. What the heck? No, I was supposed to get the iPhone SE. I was supposed to get this. Why do I have that? Are you serious? What am I gonna do? I spent like $200 on this. Oh my god. This is ridiculous. I can't believe I've been scammed. Wow. Anyways. That's unfortunate. I really thought I was going to get the new iPhone SE. Anyways, guys. Hopefully I'll get a, a refund or an iPhone SE. Because this is not what I ordered. Anyways. I hope you guys have a great day. Don't order from sketchy sellers. And don't forget to subscribe to Yes Epic Yes for more videos like this. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.